Hello world, Mike Bridmore with Utility Service Agency. Utilities face challenges with ospreys and raptors trying to nest on the power poles of their transmission and distribution systems. Freeform Line Products recognized this problem and came out with several products to alleviate with some solutions. First and foremost is our tangent cover. Here shown, this unit's 80 inches long, goes, to, goes on the insulator, covers your C-neck, your F-neck, and your J-neck insulators. Um, goes with a keeper here, pops in, easy peasy in the field. This unit's 80 inches long. We also have a unit that's 42 inches long. This unit's black. We also have a gray unit. This unit is good for line angles up to 10 degrees. Here's a gray version that articulates. Same, same concept, this unit is good for line angles up to 30 degrees. It should be noted that these are designed to be installed and left permanently in place. They are not to be in place of um, rubber sleeves or rubber hoses. They're not, not intended for gloving purposes out there in the field, but they are intended to shield the conductors from sticks that are dropped by the birds when they're trying to build these nests. And the sticks laying there um, either causing an outage immediately or causing an outage as the stick lays there and then gets wet when it starts to rain. We also have dead end covers um, out there and the dead end covers coupled with our Raptor Cuban. Our Raptor Cuban is 125 mil stick, good for up to 500, uh, good for 500 volts per mil. Comes in different sizes based on your conductor diameter. Comes in eight foot sections like this or also in a 50 foot tube roll. We also have a series of platforms to help the ospreys have a place to safely nest. Here you can see one. This is a cantilever version. We have a three foot by three foot and a five foot by five foot version. Contact Utility Service Agency. The winter time's a great time to do your quantity takeoffs on your um, problem poles to get, get the material ordered before the ospreys show back up in March.